speeches. Christmas is a cherished time for gatherings with loved ones, but not everyone has family close by. Special needs residents on Long Island found comfort and joy today together. CBS 2's Carolyn Gussoff joined in the celebration in Babylon. Oh, I love Christmas. We're like a family in this house, you know. We love each other, care about each other. You ready to open up some presents? Yes. Okay. Santa brought. The smile on Tommy Leolu Akandi's face says it all. With his parents a world away in Nigeria, this is now his family. And everything, like, and I'm so grateful, honestly. Like, they're really like my family, for real, for real. Like, just, it just makes my heart melt. I love you guys so much. Their differences bring them together from autism to other developmental disabilities here under one roof of a Catholic Charities group home. There's a holiday spirit that brings joy to a population often forgotten. <laughs> Not a single item on Santa's list has been forgotten by residential manager Diane McCoon, who orchestrated more than 60 hand-picked gifts to create a Christmas of caring. Because I really don't get to see my family, so being around here, it's like family. She like knows me really like so well. I want them to feel loved, ha happy, cared for, respected, not someone that has a disability. Merry Christmas, Billy. I have my own children and then I come here and I'm like, this is my children too. Merry Christmas, Linda. Linda, she'll call me mom because she doesn't have a mom. The greatest gift is making this house feel like home. It makes me feel happy, wanted, you know, and I'm being loved. We care about each other, you know, for Christmas. Even if we don't go home or something, we're here together. It's a scene playing out at more than a dozen group homes run by Catholic Charities of Long Island with 150 residents, many of whom consider their house Mates and the staff here, their only family. Reminding us all that Christmas is about caring for one another. This is for you. Oh, thank oh. you. So thanking you for coming and everything. Thank you. You made that? Yes, I did. And giving back. Residents are treating one another to a special Christmas dinner. In Babylon, Long Island, Carolyn Gussoff, CBS 2 News.